Hey guys, my name is Tanzil and welcome back to the channel. In this video, we are going to see how to download and install Oracle VirtualBox 7. 7 is the latest version available right now at the time of making this video. So let's open our browser and just type download VirtualBox for Windows and then in the result just open the first link that is from virtualbox.org then on the download page of virtualbox you can see that 7.0.2 is the latest version available right now we have all the links to download virtualbox for different operating systems since i am running windows operating system i am going to click on windows host and then the download is going to begin it's of 104 MB, near about 105 MB. So just let it download. Now once the download is complete, you can open the folder in which you have downloaded the virtual box. And then just right click on it. And then run as administrator. Alright, then the installer is going to open up. Just click on next. And this window we don't have to change anything let all the features of virtual box be enabled by default and uh, it's going to take 208 mb on your hard disk so make sure you have at least that much of hard disk space available and uh, if you want to change the default location of virtual box you can do that from here you can just click on browse and then browse to the location where you want to install your virtual box but if you don't have a good reason to change it i'll suggest to let it be the default one and then just click on next now it's giving a warning it says installing the oracle vm virtual box networking feature will reset your network connection which means if you click on yes button it's going to reset or disconnect your internet connection temporarily so if you are downloading something then you may want to pause or hold the installation process until your download is complete after that just click on yes then missing dependencies python core so oracle virtual box requires the python core package and the win32 api bindings so we don't have to do anything here also we can just click on yes and the virtual box is going to install the necessary dependencies which are needed to run the virtual box so just click on yes and then finally you can just click on install and the installation is going to begin once the installation is finished you can click on finish and then the oracle virtual box manager is going to open up now if you are new to Oracle VirtualBox and you want to install any operating system on VirtualBox then you can follow my other videos in which I have showed how to install Ubuntu, Mac OS, Monterey as well as Windows 11. So you can follow those videos. The link of those videos are in the description of this video. So that's all for this video. We have finished the installation of VirtualBox. It's pretty simple. So anyways I'm going to see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.